How do we know what an angel looks like? Has anyone actually seen one other than accounts, true or untrue, in the Bible? The image of angels that we carry in our collective cultural suitcase is largely a mashup of religious texts, artistic license, and a whole lot of Renaissance influence. When you stroll through the corridors of art history, you see plump cherubim, stoic guardians with swords, and the serene archangels that look more like they belong on the cover of a fashion magazine than in the ethereal realms of heaven. But have we seen them? No, not in a prove-it-in-a-lab kind of way. Most of what we know comes down from centuries of religious teachings, and the descriptions are as varied as the cultures that interpreted them. In the Bible, angels are often depicted as messengers of God. They can be awe-inspiring and, in some cases, downright terrifying. Take the book of Ezekiel. Those angels had multiple faces and wings covered with eyes. Doesn't exactly fit the Christmas tree ornament design, right? The common representation of angels as benevolent figures with halos, wings, and glowing with divine light is comforting, though. There's a universal appeal to the idea of a celestial being that watches over us. This depiction aligns with our intrinsic yearning for a protective presence, a guardian in our moments of need. Here in Portland, or really anywhere I've been, I haven't bumped into anyone with feathered wings and a halo, though the city has its fair share of characters. Yet, if we think a bit broader, countless people recount personal experiences where they felt a presence, a guide or protector, that many attribute to an angelic encounter. These are personal truths that can't be measured or held up to scientific scrutiny. They are, however, powerful to those who experience them. So, while no one can claim they've snapped a selfie with an angel down at Stumptown Coffee, the belief persists. A blend of faith, cultural storytelling, and human hope shapes what we see as the visage of an angel. Whether it's an accurate representation of a celestial being, that remains a mystery. Until then, we've all got the creative interpretations that artists and believers give us, feathers, halos, and all.